Good evening. I'm Fabian Rush, and this is when teddy bears attack. You know, I had a teddy bear once. His name was Booby, and he was my life. I did everything with him. But then, at the age of 23, my mother took him away and hid him in the attic. You see, she knew the truth about my beloved Booby. On the surface, he was all fun and cuddly games. But deep down, he was a homicidal maniac. Much like any other teddy bear, he needed constant attention. And when he didn't get it, strange things started to happen all around the house. Strange things. And so, I had to ask him to leave. Unfortunate, but it had to be done. And after the next few moments, you'll understand why. And what you're about to witness right now is a dramatic reenactment of a recent teddy bear attack. It all starts when the teddy bear whispers the word Satan into his owner's ear. Notice how the confused owner reacts. He's in a panic. He doesn't know who just said that. Then, the transformation. <clears throat> Poor son of a... <sighs> this next dramatic re... This next dramatic re... This... This next... Dr This next dramatic reenactment took place back in 1975 when a young girl was visiting her late grandmother's tombstone. Unfortunately, her older brother, who visited the gravesite earlier that same day, did not leave flowers behind, but instead, a teddy bear. And then, it's got her. animals. Just to follow up on my story, Booby did return. Unfortunately, he returned to break my arm. It was all swinging, hanging like that. I'm better now, fortunately, because the cops arrived in time to take Booby away. So remember, no matter how much you love 
your beloved teddy bears. They can turn on you in an instant, just like that. Until next time, I'm Fabian Rush, and this has been When Teddy Bears Attack.